month now since Hurricane Irma and many Bay Area neighborhoods still have storm debris all over piled up waiting to be picked up. Our Eric Waxler is taking action for you, revealing the one reason some are not getting the help they deserve. Basically, you can't see, but there's a lot of limbs laying in there that and that limb there, everything that's been dragged over. Troy Olson but says his Newport Ritchie neighborhood didn't get hit that bad by Hurricane Irma. Just a lot of downed tree limbs and some minor roof damage. I mean, there's a lot of worse areas, you know, it's just Frustrated. Frustrated because all those limbs continue to sit there with no sign Pasco County crews are coming to pick it up. Sue Sandcool has a pile right in front of her house. Hopefully another storm isn't going to come through and blow it all over and we have to re-rake it. The issue seems to be these gates. The reserve at Oak Ridge is a gated community and Pasco solid waste officials say they aren't able to collect debris inside until FEMA approves a declaration that will reimburse the county for picking up in a private neighborhood. But these residents say they are taxpayers entitled to the help. We're no different than anybody else that's in front of the gates and we just want our stuff picked up. County officials say HOA fees should be set aside to cover post-storm pickup. Just yesterday, though, crews were hauling off debris from the neighborhood just steps away. And they made a turn right by the gate and said, not coming in a gated community. The county says they are stretched thin when it comes to having the manpower to pick up the debris all over the county, but the work continues. They've also waived fees at the landfill for those who want to dump storm-related debris themselves. In Newport, Richie, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.